Hey everyone, I'm DJ Shani and today I'm playing Robin Hood The Legend of Sherwood. Let's see what we have available. Um, story mission. It seems to have infinite cooldown. Archery competition is being held in Nottingham. We're on the two turn, Prince John's troops are marching on Lincoln. It's a, a siege mission. Uh, we have to get uh, three shields. This place hasn't yet been won yet. Yeah, we need to uh, three of them by helping the defenders in some ways. Let me read this first. Lincoln is under siege. We must help Sir Godwin to keep his castle. To do this, Robin must fill all the coat of arms boxes above. Robin can buy a shield by sending men to help Sir Godwin at the risk of losing them. He can also try and bribe the enemy generals, tempting them with generous offers of money. Lastly, Robin can always try to set an ambush for the enemy soldiers. These are our uh, three options. Uh, let me show them. The first one is has this neat animation. I need volunteers. By the way, when I played this game when I was young, I, I never did this I or the money one. I I always did uh, the the Sherwood missions. I need volunteers. To get the coat of arms. Coats of arms. The blazons. I have a plan. Oh, I can already I select them. Volunteers. See, I can't select the the story characters, but I can select these dudes. And if I send them over there, I have a plan. Have they start filling up. Be careful. And then if I click this, I convert the guys into uh, the blazons and I get the message that it's done. I won't read this, I'll read this when I've actually done. Oh and you see a derby mission popped up. It's a, no, it's a reverse siege mission, I know it's, we are, it's us who lay the siege. Enough things the time has come to launch the attack. Um, I suspect that this will come up later in the story. If not, I already have a, a save that has this available. So um, if I complete the game and end up not doing this, I'll do it afterwards. So there will be videos of every uh, uh, mission. Okay, our second option is to buy these blazons uh, with our money. See, I have 20, uh, 75,000 and one uh, coat of arms is 2,000, so I can buy them like, like these. But I'm always going to use the, the third option. <coughs> Strange our game didn't crash this time. I wonder if it's uh, because I did the uh, buy coat of arms options or because I didn't have all three of them. I wonder if I bought all three of them it would have crashed. I don't want to try that though. Uh, and this is uh, I can get coat of arms by completing Sherwood missions uh, and uh, they are not sort of linear. Uh, they are chosen from a bunch of random. They are randomly chosen from a bunch of missions like now I have a small group of stray soldiers the enemy sends out some scouts. Unfortunately, I can't prove this random theory. Let's load it back. I can't prove this random theory for the first two choices because they always stay the same for me. But it might be because uh, the missions are distributed between these three points whenever I come back to... to uh, oh, the fuck one. Okay. Whenever I come back to this uh, Sherwood uh, uh, setting, and not when I, so when I load the game back, it's already decided. But I can uh, prove it for the second choice. See, I've I've done one of those missions that were available. It's just uh, to showcase it. And afterwards, what I have available now. Uh, two missions, uh, the sheriff's men search the forest and uh, reinforcements attempt to join the enemy. Let's load it back again.
And now it shows and searches forest and an enemy patrol. But if I load it back again. Oh, what I noticed is that if I quit like this, like immediately then I get the same two missions. And these two missions remain whenever I quit immediately. So I don't know, maybe the the random selection is uh, based on how long I spend in the game, maybe. Because if I load it back again, I don't know, let's tie up two people and let's money check him, he's got no money. You'll see, don't worry, you'll see this mission later. Now I'm just showcasing the, using it to show you the randomness of the missions selection. See, now it's different again. The reverse and the reinforcements. And for the third choice, we get a third choice when um, the first missions we can get one coat of arms. Then uh, we get the second missions where we can get two of them. But if I choose to get just. Oops, sorry, wrong, wrong save. It's. Uh, which one is that? It's this one. See now I only got two, uh, one uh, coat of arms for getting rid of these people but there's also still another one I could get but I choose not to because it's too hard for me. And now what we get is a, a Sherwood mission which if I chose to do then I would lose Lincoln because they have uh, the same cooldown. It ha one of them has to be done immediately. I'll show you the Sherwood mission as well uh, and uh, if I do it I lose Lincoln and uh, I've never done that in uh, when I played uh, when I was young so it's totally new to me that uh, I read on the internet that if I lose Lincoln then later I'll get uh, the reverse siege mission when I have to take back Lincoln from the Prince John, uh, Prince's uh, troops. See now I have uh, three uh, options, the sheriff's man, search the forest reinforcements and uh, transporting the soldiers wages. But if I do the loading and quitting again, <coughs> excuse me, it's a messenger crosses the forest searching and reinforcements. So. Uh, it's a different one. And sometimes in, in the place of this it's a sort of food mission when we have to get rid of the uh, or steal the soldiers uh, food. So what I'm going to do now is uh, show you first the missions that some of these missions uh, I mean all of them but uh, I'll leave uh, for last the missions that I'll actually do before this story mission. So the last two Sherwood missions will be the ones that sort of stay in my gameplay. The bad weather has separated this small group of soldiers from the rest of the troops. Oh, and I can send whoever I want. Alright, let's do this. These men have been separated from the unit by the bad weather. In this war each soldier counts and there's... Let me adjust the volume. Thank you. Uh, in this war each soldier counts and there's the opportunity for Robin to take this little group out of the fight. Nice light ride by Leo John. What is it? It's a floating coat of arms. Oh, there's Ale! Courtesy of... <laughs> Jeez. He's so happy for one single bottle. What good luck, Ale! Well, here's a good opportunity to rest a while. Come on. An hour's break before we set off. And they get brutally ambushed. Yeah, we can't do nothing with that. No, please don't trigger whatever that is. No. 
No, put that away! Thank you. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's gone. I could have Merlin stand up, lure them there. Nah, no, these groups are perfect for fire trucks, bees. I think I'll have to assign more people to uh, bees nests or wasps nests collection. Please, thank you. And Johnny Boy can knock them out. Are you all right? Oh. The archer first. Oh, I thought the sergeant would wake him. Good, good, good. Which was the quick save button? F5? No, F1. I'll definitely have more people do the bees nests. I'll call them bees nests. You'll have to bear with that. Same as with the Stutley instead of Stutley. Just for the sake of my convenience. That is the most important thing. Good. I'll try without. Nah, because the guy's facing us would notice us. Plot twist. This mouse. Oh no, little John, stay there. Let the wasps do their work first. Knock, 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 knock. Sorry, little one. Come here, little one. Hit the guy, please. Come on. Sweet dreams. These men will never join their unit. We must leave before anyone comes looking for them. Well, if uh, anyone would come looking for them, they could just free them. And let's not forget the money check, of course. No money! Oh, another reason why I brought Robin, of course, is that he can do money check. No money on the sergeant! Well, yeah, actually, that's realistic because you know they're they're going to war. So why would they carry money with them? With the disappearance of these few soldiers, the enemy will surely consider deserting. A small group of soldiers accompanying a messenger has just been sighted. This man must be taking an important message to the enemy. You must make sure it doesn't reach his destination in time and he has the same model as a uh, nobleman in city missions why not a god forbid a, a horseman okay I'm not doing these kinds of missions because people fucking die 
and it of course uh, affects my lives spared uh, percentage. Jesus Christ! It's horrible. It's just horrible. I think there's no way we can do any kind of strategy here. So let's just go with them. And then he notices us. Robin, fight good, yes. Hit guy, oh. Good. My strategy. Robin, fight good. Hit people. And then quick save. I hope I won't forget checking. Um, won't forget to check the life spare percentage, but I'm fairly certain. I'm 100% certain that this affects it. Please let me be wrong. Oh, that's bad. Robin, fight good. Robin, don't fight bad. Oh, well, we could lure them away. He's just running in circles. That guy is just running in circles. Come here, little one. Oh, they are literally surrounded by archers. I see what they did there. Robin hit. Uh, I mean, little John hit the archers. What, what happened there? Hit the fucking. How did. Oh, yeah. He wasn't in the. In cover. Play attack. We uh, so exposed him. Oh, the messenger fell in a hole. And I think we have also. Yeah, we got all of them. This message was intended for a small group of elite soldiers who were hiding in Sherwood Forest. In search of Robin. Now Robin knows where to find them. He'll easily be able to drive them out of his domain. Does that unlock? You should accomplish this time to return to Sherwood. Yay. Money check. Just so the viewers know that he had some money. And for sort of uh, posterity because I'm not going to save this. But the sergeant has 55 pounds on him. No one else I suspect. Messenger has been in intercepted, giving Robin and his allies the advantage over their adversaries. Oh, I forgot to check. Oh, did, did you see? I think I saw that uh, there were 17 soldiers and four died. Those uh, three, uh, <laughs> four in the beginning of the level. 